Hi, this is John Leone, and I'm here today to show you a program called uh, Essential Grocer. What it is, it's a Windows 10 app that works on the Windows 10 phone and will work on the Windows 10 desktop that maintains grocery lists. You create them, you edit them, you can save them, and you can open new lists so far. Uh, eventually, uh, before it's released, we will also add the ability to email as well as print. Without further ado, let's go to Simple Grocery. I mean, Essential Grocery. <laughs> and uh, do we got it on the screen good? Okay, we got it on the screen good. Now, this is uh, menu here is just for which category you want. We'll start with produce. And uh, we'll put some artichokes, uh, some green onions, uh, some Savoy cabbage. And let's say we don't want the green onions. We click that and it goes away. And uh, then we want to get some bakery goods in there. Uh, let's get a cheese bun and hamburger rolls. And then we want to take this list and save it for uh, a, either a future list or to send to someone else. So we'll save it. Now the cool thing about Windows apps, they default to giving you the ability to go to the OneDrive. So we'll go to the OneDrive, and um, in the OneDrive, in the Documents folder, I made a folder called Simple Groceries. <laughs> that was the original name, Simple Groceries. We were working on the name, and we came up with Essential Groceries. And that just picks that folder, and then uh, for the name, uh, we'll just call it... Uh, what are you going to call it? Uh, yours. <laughs> okay, let's. Okay. And then we'll write to disk. Takes a second. Now, when we go back, it's still here. But if we start a new list, say the following week, and we want to take those groceries and yours and make it like every week you get the same essentials. So you just get it started. So you click open. Go back to the OneDrive, and then in Documents, uh, simply Groceries, and uh, what the heck is yours? Oh, here it is. <laughs> and we'll click that, and then we just hit Check, and there's your list from last week. And uh, that's about it so far. Um, it's currently XML based. Here, why don't you come up to me now? Uh, it's currently XML based for your techies. That's how the data goes back and forth. Um, the, uh, the whole program is open source software and it's going to be a free software on the app store, uh, Windows Store, whatever they call it. And uh, that's about it. Uh, it's a start. I think I may do others, but First things first, let's see if I could finish this, get it on the store, and, uh, you know, we could start a give and take with our users. Have a good day.